hey everyone welcome back to my channel and I am coming on to share with you my process video number two uh, for the hashtag MM dream team for the mermaid moods designer series paper that was created by our own sweet miss melody from melody made here on YouTube and part of the digital kit were these huge um, tags and I saw this some time ago uh, from Pam at the paper outpost and I thought this would be the perfect size for this project so um, in the designing series uh, kit you get some lined some uh, unlined different images and I created a tablet a writing tablet and this is how it turned out now this was the very first time I did this and um, there's some things that I would like to do over now I just recently purchased a laminating machine but when I did this I did not have one and my daughter had uh, given me some self uh, laminating sheets and that's what I use I use one sheet to make this one and it's really sturdy and it's meant for you to be able to insert it into your um, journal and then that gives you the pressure to be able to write without worrying about items that are underneath that might um, that might uh, interrupt your writing now um, I did cut out the same two pieces like this but this was the patterns that I chose and I backed it up on a cardboard box now this happens to be a cereal box um, but it's similar to what I use here it might have been the other half of this and as long as your paper is covered from end to end you're going to use the design paper to sandwich that and then you're going to cut it around at this point you'll have all three pieces glued together and then you can decorate this however you want because it's going to sit underneath the the laminated sheet so in my case i use um, the die cuts that i had uh, done previously and there goes my little C theme there. I did use some gold uh, wax um, and went around the edges. It's a metallic wax and I think this is it right here. Oh, this is a silver one. But I used the gold. And I just went around all the edges. So you can see it there. It's gold. You can see it better there. And then just smear a little bit off now this can also be used as a dry erase so if you want to leave yourself quick little notes you're more than able to do that as well now doing this over my mistake was that I went too far to the edge so I have a border on three sides instead of all four but I think it still came out super cute and it'll sit nicely in the journal and this is the journal that I'm working on for my project and I don't want to show you what it looks like on the cover just yet but I will show you that it is getting quite chunky and if you let's just go into a no I don't want to give away any secrets no okay let's just pick this one so say I'm writing in my journal and I have embellishments on the other side I can just take this slide it in the back and then just write and it gives me the stability that I need um, that was my thought on this one I'm making this it can also be a big bookmark if you want it to be and then when you open it up and you're ready to write it's at the ready and you can write and it's thin enough to be able to fit in your journal so 
that's my second process share guys i would have done it completely from beginning to end but i believe i did couldn't find any more of these self laminating sheets but it's really simple if i can do it you can do it just don't do what i did and go all the way to the edge leave yourself um some space so you'll have an equal border and like i said i can't fussy cut to save my life so this is like super uneven but i loved it and um as soon as i saw this i thought this was perfect um to finally do that little writing tablet for journals and i might continue to do that for all my journals really now that i got a laminating machine all right guys i hope you enjoyed that stay blessed stay healthy stay safe of course links in my description box will be on how you can find this kit um and all the information from our creators and the dream team we're all creating and designing we've had the opportunity to play with um, this paper for more than a month and I've been taking my sweet time with this cutie right here so I can't wait to show her to you uh, so stay tuned for the big reveal which will be uh, May 7th as always catch you at the next one guys bye <laughs>